Hi friends, welcome to Unsolved. So today it is the 40th episode in the activity series. So today it's not exactly an activity. So I'll show my drawings which I made. Many drawings which I made in my in my laptop using paint, Microsoft Paint, not any other paint. So there are many of them. So I need to divide these in this into many different episodes. So this would be like a series. So yeah, and also. There are many, so I can't show my face because I'm re recording this in my laptop and I so don't know how to put a face cam. So yeah, so let's start with so let's start with the first drawing, the ten independent Indian states. That means if all Indian states got independence, but they're continuously in war with each other until only ten states remain. Uh, these I think there would be. I mean, I guess there would be the Tamil Empire, which went up to here. Just the Tamil area is here, but they went all up to here then. So there's the Maratha Empire, next West Bengal, the Thar kings from Rajasthan, the Uttar Pradesh. And actually, the, Uttar, the state of Uttar Pradesh is pretty big, but now it is the, its neighbors completely eaten it up. Not completely, but kind of eaten it up, except West Bengal, which didn't even touch it. Kind of, it borders it, but doesn't do anything to it. Next, the Kingdom of Kashmir and Punjab. Next, the Kingdom of Sikkim, which is still the smallest state in smallest here. So in real life, also Sikkim is the smallest state in all of India. Next, here is some East Kashmir, which I don't know what was running in my head, but this is not. The, this is definitely not even Kashmir, near Kashmir. Next here is East Assam. So that is the drawing. So next is 1914 Europe. So you may think that what is so special inside this. This is just 1914 Europe, right? You may have just copied it. But that is not true because I took a map of present day Europe and I edited it until it looked like 1914 Europe. So I saw in images and Finally, got the correct image. That means correct, correct. So I saw an image of 1914 Europe. So and then I edited it like that. So then we got this. Okay. Next same for 1939 Europe, but instead of 1914, it is 1939. So both years were the start. I mean, what the years before a world war. Yes. So next. A suggestion for a new country that is Dravida. So this would get in. So its capital would be in Chennai here. It's it got independence from China. I mean India, not China. And it only borders India only, not any other country. Its government type is a federal parliamentary constitutional republic. Its official languages would be Tamil, Telugu, Malayalam, and Kannadam. So Tamil is speaking here. The Telugu up here in Andhra, next Malayalam in Kerala, in Kannadam in Karnataka. Yes, uh, Andaman. So, the next, the currency is the Dravidian rupee or the DVR, and the official name is the Republic of Dravida. Dravida. Then, the demonium is the Dravidian or uh, is Dravidium. So, this is the flag of Dravida, it is pretty black and similar to Japan, but the background is completely in reverse. So the states would be the state of Andaman, Nicobar, separate states, not actually one state here. In India, they are both same union territories instead of even states, and they are both united. Next, state of Nicobar, state of Andhra, state of Tamil Nadu, state of Karnataka, state of Kerala, and Lux the state of Luxembourg. So now it is Lakshadweep in from Hindi, but there the most people girls are Malayali or speak Malayali, Malayalam from Kerala, which is the language of Kerala. So that's why he translated it to Kerala. And also Laksam means la one lakh islands. Yes. Laksam means islands and Dweep means, I mean Laksam means lakh and Dweep means islands. So next is Africa in balls. So this has uh, this has all countries in Africa in country balls as country balls. If you don't know country balls, it's like a type of drawing in which countries are shown as like balls. And there will be sometimes comics to show the interactions between them. 
So here I'll show the Kanjis with only props because there would it would take a lot of time to show all of these. Yes. So starting with the north, we have Morocco, which is wearing a traditional Muslim hat called the fizz. Next here, Egypt is has is playing with its pyramid nicely. While next down here, Ghana is doing the coffin dance. So if you don't know the famous meme coffin dance originated from Ghana itself, and they were nearby countries looking at it. Well, Cameroon is trying to look at it, but Nigeria is blocking its way. The next, the Central African Re Republic is a car, but you may ask, why is it even a car? So, if we turn a car into a short, I mean, Central African Republic into a short form, we'll get C A R, which car? Yes, it is car. So next is Somalia, which is just as a pirate, and I don't know why it is a pirate exactly. The DRC is pretty sad here. Next here is Botswana, a literal bot. In its name, there is bot, right? So because of that, it is mostly shown as a bot, robot. So it has a red laser eye, and Zimbabwe and Mozambique are scared. While Malawi and Zambia see what? Why is it? What is happening down here? Like that. Why? Well, and finally, the last robbed country ball is a Swatini with its traditional Zulu shield and sword and spear. I don't know what this is, so that's why I'm going to skip it. So, next is the alternate map of Europe and its surroundings. So, this is an alternate map. So, there are many different countries here, including the Maghreb. So, the, including some countries outside of Europe itself. So, in the Mag so all of the countries down here in the Maghreb region. If you don't know, Maghreb region is a region in, in North Africa. So, the Mag they, they found the Maghreb Kingdom or the Maghreb Union. While here, they found these countries found the Eastern Middle East Union. Eastern Middle East. It sounds very pretty different. So then, here is the country of Constantinople, or the Kingdom of Constantinople, or Istanbul. Yes, which got whose capital is Istanbul itself. So next is Southern Yugoslavia and Northern Yugoslavia. Both are different. This is a kingdom, and this is a communist republic. Yes. Now here is the Republic of Genoa. Next year is Catalonia and Galicia. Next, France had nothing happened to it. While the UK got lots of land up here, including Iceland and all of Ireland. Here is the Benelux Union, or also known as the Lowland Union. The Germans united most of the German lands, including, well, here Slovakia got a bit from Ukraine. Romania lost a lot. By Hungary got the Vojvodina area of which is in the northern like hat of S Serbia and also the Transylvania region of guess it, Romania. So then Poland lost the Silesia but at least got Kaliningrad. Next Moldova got more land and also it is a bit, a bit different. Next Crimea got independence as a Crimean kingdom. Next here, all the Caucasian countries got united as the Caucasian Kingdom Union. Next, here Denmark got a bit from Sweden. And Sweden is pretty weak because Finland also attacked it and got this land. Which is pretty very close to the capital, Stockholm. And Finland got lost this part but denied access to Russia for, to Norway. Yes, so here. You can see that. The next Russia lost lot lost lots of land. Then the two Baltic states, Lithuania and Latvia, both united. While up here, new kingdom found called the Kingdom of Saint Petersburg. They, they both annexed the country of Estonia. So then I think I said all of the changes in some time. <laughs> so then we have Asia in balls, which is 
literally a shell not balls so i'll also show again prop you can this with props okay so, so first starting with saudi arabia saudi arabia has its like traditional thing i don't know what it's called but including oil because it has lots of oil next israel which is for some reason shown as a cube instead of just the normal round ball and also and same for same for Kazakhstan but I forgot to do it it's as shown as like a brick normally so next I don't know why I draw them in reverse <laughs> well, yeah okay so all of here it is looking normal next Russia is drinking its vodka peacefully <laughs> and also Indonesia is wearing a farmer's hat <laughs> yes so then these are the bricks so if you don't know the BRICS is an intergovernmental union uh, I mean an organization between five countries Brazil for B, Russia for R, next India for I, China for C and South Africa for S so B or I C S BRICS so yeah okay but I did forgot I didn't put them in order because first I just drew the run countries randomly but then I later wanted to put the name ta name plates but I saw that uh, what should I do I already placed them in a random way so and finally for today I'll finally show Europe in balls it is same as Africa and also uh, the country I mean the continent of Asia in balls but this time it's Europe uh, so I will again show countries with props. So there are three countries with which have an eye patch. They are Serbia with an eye patch, next Slovakia with an eye patch, and Slovenia with an eye patch. So they have eye patches to show like their symbol. So they have the symbol like this, right? So see. And fine. And next is the UK with the, these. I don't know what they're called, but it's some call something for so the things which the I, the glasses with just one hole for one eye only. <laughs> I could call them that for some time. And Russia is just sleeping. I don't know why. So this is for today about some things about some dra drawings I made. So there's still more about this. So I made make another video about this. So. Bye.